Hello everybody, today I'm going to do a summary of the first week of the Hair Growth Challenge 2017. Don't hesitate to tell me in the comment section down below what you did for the first week of the challenge. The first point is neck and scalp massages for at least 5 minutes and I only missed one day but I did it every single day except for one for more than five minutes and I didn't do it for one day because I completely forgot. So what you can do is to stick a reminder card, reminder card, I don't know if it's the name for it but you have to put something that will remind you that you have to do your scalp massages every day. So you can stick your reminder card on the wall, for example, or on the fridge, something like that. But I really advise you to do the scalp massages every single day because it really helps to stimulate hair growth. The second point is a balanced diet rich in nutrients. So in my case, I'm not satisfied at all because my first week of the challenge was very poor in nutrients because it was a very busy, tiring and stressful week. So I didn't have the time to really cook some food and really prepare uh, the food for me to eat. So that was a little bit complicated. I was... Um, lacking organization. The first day of the challenge was the 15th of October, so it was on a Sunday and I didn't eat much actually because I was very focusing on editing videos and when I have to work sometimes I don't eat that much which is a very bad habit but I actually ate one or two bananas on the morning with one capsule of alfalfa so this is my dietary supplement and the capsule look like this you can see yeah so this is a leaf powder and during the rest of the day, I just ate bananas, so it's very quick to eat, so <laughs> I just ate bananas. And for dinner, I ate garlic curry rice salad with soy protein. On Monday, I ate one banana and one capsule of alfalfa on the morning. And for lunch, I ate cereals in vanilla soy milk. Yes, it's not a real lunch, but at least I ate something. And for dinner, I ate the same rice salad as Sunday. On Tuesday, I ate one banana, one capsule of alfalfa. I didn't eat for lunch, but when I came from school, I ate a snack. So the snack um, contains bananas, apples, melted chocolate, and almond butter. For dinner, I ate the same rice salad as the days before, but I added mushrooms because I really love mushrooms. On Wednesday, I ate one banana and I forgot to take one capsule of alfalfa. I ate the same snack as the day before and for dinner, I ate a plant-based sandwich. On Thursday, on the morning, I ate raisins and I didn't eat for lunch, but I ate the same snack as Tuesday and for dinner, I ate a plant-based sandwich again. <laughs> On Friday morning, I ate raisins on the morning and a plant-based sandwich for dinner. <laughs> so as you could see, my first week of the challenge was not very rich in nutrients, but on the weekend, I really decided to cook some food for me. But I would not say that it was not rich in nutrients, but um, I like to eat different kinds of meal. So, yeah, that was the problem. I didn't find the time to to eat different kind of meals, so it was very often the same meals. On Saturday, I cooked vegetarian mafe, which is a meal from West Africa. This is a friend from Gambia that inspired me to cook this meal. So Aminata, if you see this video, thank you again. I also made a giant cookie for myself because I really wanted to eat this. 
The third point of the challenge is sport for at least three times a week. So me for the first week of the challenge, I didn't run, but I rode my bike a lot because I usually bike to school. For the protective style, I had twist for the first two weeks of the challenge. And of course, every night I would protect my hair with my satin scarf. For the point number six of the challenge, I used this oil as I told you before and I applied it on the tips of my hair mainly. And of course, I didn't wash my hair at the end of the first week of the challenge because I already washed it at the beginning of the challenge and usually I wash my hair every two weeks. That's it for this video. Don't forget to tell me how it's going for you. Bye bye.